up guys long time no see I know it's been a hot minute for a regular vlog Whoop. I'm gonna shop y'all oh I, I'm just leaving the dollar store <clears throat> I had to grab some stuff for my hair and um, some personal items and now I'm just on my way to head home to my booker um, Mark is still in the hospital but he's down in Milwaukee and he's doing so much better he's doing so so much better and he's going to give me an update when he gets home and then I'll have a, a full story time video with you guys on as to what happened and I have video and picture from all this time which has just been crazy um, I literally rushed him to the ER on April 22nd and it is um, it is May 23rd it's a, a whole month later a whole month and a day later so there's a lot a lot that I have to tell you guys <coughs> and I will as soon as I am able to um, get the um, information from Mark to give you guys um, what's been going on with me other than you know making sure that Mark's been okay is I've been working like crazy and right now like I had ended up while I was in Milwaukee like I was in Milwaukee for a week um, when he the you know a couple I had he had went down there on like a Friday I mean like a Wednesday and I got down there on a Friday and so I was there for like a whole entire week and while I was there I ended up having to go to the emergency room because I had such a bad cough I felt like my lung had collapsed my cough was so bad and I still have the cough to this day and it's like two weeks later and they said that I had bronchitis and you know I'm out, I was on steroids and all this other stuff and I feel like shit still you know like it's been horrible like look at my hair like I haven't even been I, I, I've been looking a hot freaking mess like <clears throat> so I've been working through that and everything and so it's just been like so crazy but now I'm home home by myself with Precious Tara's still in Milwaukee um, she's going to be down there for the summer um, probably through the fall as well visiting family and also helping Brittany out with my grandbaby so um she'll she's down there and then mark obviously still in the hospital keeping our fingers crossed that he is home within the next couple of weeks that's what we're hoping for we're hoping that by the mid to end of may i'm at mid to end of june that he is home um so yeah that's kind of in a nutshell what's been going on and i just thank you guys so much for sticking by me and you know i um, continuing to ask you know when a video is getting uploaded and things like that and I really appreciate it and um, I haven't really been updating other than on my Facebook about um, stuff that's been going on so um, you know my follow my face you know go find me on Facebook you know on Instagram snapchat snapchat I I tend to be on there mostly um, so if you're not following me on snapchat make sure you follow me on snapchat so that way you guys can stay updated with everything that's going on oh you guys look at my nails they're done I don't even know if you guys can tell well in the camera it actually looks the right color it's supposed to be a dark green but everybody's like oh my god they look so black and so soon I hopefully I can get a color change my cousin got my nails done while I was in Milwaukee, which was really nice to actually, like, get something done for myself and, you know, not <coughs> have to think about things for, like, the hour or so that I was in there, you know, so that was really nice, but I just got some hair stuff and I'm about to go home and put this fan together that Mark had ordered before he even went into the hospital, um, just haven't put it together because last night in my sleep, I was sweating so bad, I was so hot and I couldn't open up the window like I wanted to because it was like storming out and um, I was just like, oh, forget it. So I just, you know, slept through the night as best as I could and today my goal is to get that fan together so that tonight I am not, um, I'm sweating like a pig <laughs> like I already feel like a pig I don't want to be sweating like a pig but um yeah it's all gloomy today 
here to show you guys. This it's all rainy here in Green Bizzle. It is rainy. Sorry for like my manly voice, you guys. Like to me, my voice sounds so deep. It sounds so deep. Um, and this is gonna be a one take, by the way. I'm just gonna talk to you guys on my way home because when I get home, I'm just putting together a fan, editing this video, and probably watch a movie and go to sleep. So not gonna be on much. Um, but, um, but yeah, that's kind of what's been going on. Um, what have you guys been, has anything been going on with you guys? Let me know down in the comments below. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, and, you know, um, definitely, definitely leave Mark your well wishes. He does watch the video, so he will read the comments down below as well. Um, so I know he would appreciate all the thoughts and prayers for him for a speedy recovery, which he is doing amazing, by the way. Um, he is having doctors in awe by his recovery and you know how fast he's recovering and just his recovery as a whole you know people weren't su su they were surprised to see him do things so fast you know and be better you know get well so fast you know but um but definitely keep him in your thoughts and prayers because it's even after he comes home it's going to be a lengthy process for him to um get fully better you know so um we are going to be you know doing what we can do to make sure that he is strong and gets back to his old self and that is our goal so um but i'm done talking to you guys' ear off it's been almost seven minutes of a one take video with you guys um and yeah i love you guys to death and um i appreciate all the love and continued support and um you guys will now be getting vlogs since everything's getting a little bit back to normal even though mark is at home um so just be keeping an eye out for that uh, you're awesome make sure to like the video comment below make sure you subscribe hit that notification bell so you guys get notified when i do upload even though it may not be at a, on a regular schedule right now and i will see you guys next time bye Straight out the mud, yeah, I came up from nothing Got it on my own, all me, no stunting Stand behind my bars like I was in fucking prison On some 2020 shit, making niggas get my vision A year ago, wasn't too many fucking with me Shout out to everybody that's fucking with me You when I blow up, ain't too many coming with me I'm at the top, she wants the title, she can come and get me I be flowing, I be going like a motherfucker On some rocket shit, taking off in this motherfucker